Hey y'all, what's up peoples? Uh, I hope y'all can see me. Um, This video is going to be a stockpile haul. Not a stock. This is a, I'm messing up already. This is going to be a, yeah, a stockpile tour. Not a haul. A stockpile tour. I'm going to show you guys my stockpile from the last time I did it, which I think was maybe in March or something like that. And I hope I'm not cut off. I hope y'all can see me. But um, it was maybe March, I think. Because I had that break last year. And I started back this year couponing. So I'm going to show you guys what I have gotten. What my stock probably like. And also, um, I saw a little bit small. I think that's her channel. A little bit small. Um, she kind of motivated me to... <laughs> Um, do my garage like organize it so throughout this tour I'm gonna show you how junky kind of my garage is um, it's just stuff sitting in different places and it's bothering me because it's just there so and then I'll come back maybe um, maybe in a week or two and show you guys what I have done to um, make a change if that makes sense so yeah with that being said i am about to get up and show you what i have um i haven't coupon for food much just did a little bit like coupons when i go grocery shopping or something like that so this is all going to be health and beauty and household products so let's get started okay you guys so let me get up. All right. So, let's see. We're going to start over here. Um, this is just like uh, the first little shelving unit. Only thing beside it is my washer and dryer. So, um, it's like the shelving unit. And this is like my shampoo and conditioners. Well, the shampoos is up here. Got all my shampoos and stuff up here. And down here is supposed to be my um that's like a pack of soap that should not be there that was open. But these are the conditioners that I have. Now I have made little bundle sacks or whatever. Um before I did this video. Put that there. And then down here is just some of my perfume and cologne testers. There's not really nothing there. Um, some of this, you're going to see spaces like right here. I have a space down here. And that's just because um, I'm trying to keep everything in order where I want, you know. I've always been like that since I've been couponing. Is I try to put the shampoos and conditioners and stuff on the same shelf. So, you know, when I, as I get more, I'll put it there. But this is what I have on my first shelf. All right, so let's go. See, right here is my little workstation. When I do my bundles, my baskets, and stuff like that, um, I did have it on the pool table. I just cleared the pool table off because sometimes I come out here and the release stress. I want to play pool, and my pool table had so much stuff on it because I was actually using it for a work table. So <laughs> I just moved everything, you know, over here or whatever. So. Um, my second shaving unit is up here. I have body washes for females. I think it's some lotion right here. Let me see. Instead of moving, let me just try to zoom in for you guys. You can see. And this soap should not be there. It was open. I forgot why all this, the bar soap getting open. But yeah, this is um, the top shelf okay so down here at the bottom we have some well i don't know did y'all get to see the top really good got tone and soft soap and nivea and st ives and suave okay so down here is mainly the men's body wash and stuff so we got some suave for men some old spice some dove some iris spring some suave um deodorant perfume that do not supposed to be there uh, some shaving gel this is a women's act thing which is probably gonna go in a um, gift basket um, but yeah I'll move that 
Okay, you guys. On the third shelf, I have some cleaning supplies, which is y'all saw me when I hold how those Clorox wipes um, from Dollar General. Then we got some soft scrub. What's this? Clorox foamer. Some Clorox um, stuff. Um, then we have a lot of dish detergent and dishwasher um, detergents and some gloves. And it's like a random soap right here. Hand soap. I just put that up here. So then over here on this unit, um, and I have some flushable cleaning wipes and stuff right here. Um, that I need to put away. Um, so yeah. Um, so over here we have the lotions. I have some Suave, some St. Ives, some Eucerin, Vaseline. Got a lot of Nivea lotion. Suave, St. Ives. This is the Palms Cream. Um, I have some Nivea Soft. And then we just got some of the smaller ones. Then down here is some mouthwash, which I got to up my mouthwash, y'all. I'm low on that. And here is a whole bunch of deodorants, all types of deodorants. Um, then over here, I got a good little stash of toothpaste. And then down here were just some random drinks that I was using when I was going to the flea market um, to sell. So, yeah, I'm going to be moving that out as I get stuff to fill that spot. But as of right now, it's fine right there. And then I just got stuff. This is what I mean. Like, little stuff like this, y'all, is just sitting. I just need to organize. I know this bag right here is to be donated along with the bag over there. This is, like, one of my husband's um, military bags. I don't know what's in it um, or whatever. So, I don't mess with that. Um... But the other two bags beside it was also for donations. So, yeah, you guys. Um, so, up here is a uh, thing of Scott's paper towels. These are some of the bounty um, cleaning towels. And then I got some Scott's tissue. Then over here, I have um, some feminine wipes and then a little pack of Kleenex and a couple little things of Kleenex right there and then I have a lot of feminine care products liners and these are just randomly put up here with some gum um, I have to make sure it's not expired because I think I had it a minute um yeah then we got some more feminine products then down here, some baby stuff, some desitin, some, I don't have no small babies, so I'm going to probably be giving it away. Um, I keep these wipes though, because when we travel, y'all know I'm from Mississippi, my husband's from New York, so we are a distance from home, so whenever we travel, these little wipes come in good, and even if we take a trip, sometimes we just take a trip, you know. Um, those wipes come good for the kids and the, being in the vehicle or whatever. So, yeah. Then, <laughs> this is my favorite rolls of toilet paper, y'all. Now, I told y'all that because um, when I get over to my paper stock, I, I don't be wanting to go through my paper stock if I can get this because the kids just want to go use toilet paper just like it's, you know, nothing. So, yeah. So, that's my paper stock. Over here, y'all saw in the video, I had got these things on clearance. They was $1.49, but I ended up getting them for $0.49. Cents. So I just kind of laid this stuff right here. See, I got to get a bin for that. Um, a little bit small in her video when she did her um, her thing. I loved her bins, and I seen them at Walmart, like $3.97. So I'm probably going to get a couple of those, or either the Dollar Tree. But I really liked her bins for like these whatnots like this. That's what I would use mine for. So in here is just some... Um, Nivea lip cream and some what's this? Al make color and y'all know I don't do makeup, so I do lipstick every now and then, but not really. Um, then down here I have to get my game up on my 
garbage bags because I'm low on it. But there's nothing really. I think this is something. Oh, this is my dog toys. I had bought them. I got to give them to them. And there's nothing really down there. The kids um, controllers to their cars. So, yeah. So, so far, I have that shelf that have that stuff on it. I have that shelf. I have that shelf. And I have that shelf. So now let's go on around. This is my upright freezer. It's kind of naked right now in there. So I'm not going to open it. So over here I have another shelf. With all my paper goods on it. As you guys can see. Got a lot of paper goods. And I want to keep it that way for now. <laughs> so um, then I got laundry detergents. You can see. Laundry detergent also down here. Yeah, boy. And then in here, if I can sit right here. Oh, okay. That was a uh, like a, a decorative stool thing. Let me show you guys that I had in the top. Um, it's it wasn't always so when I saw down it snapped down. So, all right, you guys. In here, I think I have just some. Um, Okay, so I'm like the big pencils and um, Sharpies and glue sticks, just pretty much like little school supply stuff, which I have another big bin that's over here. Um, they got school supply stuff in it, but it's kind of covered now, so probably dump that soon. And then this just has some random stuff in it. I need to put that over there. There's some... Physician formula, I think this was. No, it wasn't. Yes, it is. Physician formula. Here's some random little stuff. Um, same right here. Random little stuff. Fillers for baskets, pretty much. Is what that would be for. Okay. So, on to the next shelf. Over here, I have all my... For breeze and glaze. There's some razors up there that could not have been hung on my pegboard because um, they were broke right here. So, uh, yeah, excuse my nails. They probably like yellow looking right now. These two are because I was eating some chicken that my husband had put curry seasoning in it. And it always get me, they'll be like yellow for a day. And as I continue to wash my hands, it'll go away. So that's why it's like that. <laughs> So, um, it was only these two here, as you can see, these two have like the tenant to it, but yeah. Um, okay, so my pet board, let me go up above this. My pet board, I have razors. Let me see if I can bring you in. I have all type of razors. And wax melts. And a little bit of toothbrushes. Dental floss more razors these are the car fresheners from Febreze blade wax melts razors yes so back down um I showed you this with a Febreze and the glade then I have some more detergent these are the flings and the uh, you know the power thingies so yeah detergent down here I have my Liquid starch back there for the clothes. Got some, um, some, um, what is it? Fabric, um, sheets. Got some more glaze, some air wick, and I have my fabric softeners on this shelf. And nothing pretty much at the bottom. Just that, um, the, the torch fuel that I, um, excuse me, you guys. The torch fuel that I had, um, um, haul the other day that was on clearance and that's pretty much for that side you guys so that is my stop house and see I have all my fish and stuff over there it's just junky over there and I hate that and I'm the candy lady on my street so this bin is full of my snacks and then it's chips right there and then when I was doing my food stuff at the flea market these was my machines which was my nacho machine, my nacho chips warmer, my snow cone machine, my ice maker. So I got to get that stuff and put it up for now. So I can use that table. And then my generators and stuff is over here. So yeah, I just need to like kind of clean 
that stuff out, you guys. And I have my small refrigerator. It was for the sodas for when the kids come by drinks or whatever. So, yeah, you guys. So, let me see. And then, let me see. Then it was just, and then on the other part, um, I had to find a spot for my husband's, whatever that thing is, the thingy. And then pool sticks is there, and I'm just like, ah. Oh. So, yeah, I just really got to organize my garage, you guys. <laughs> so, yeah, you see my stockpile, though. So, yeah, you guys. So, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Um, yeah, this is my stockpile since January. How it has grown. Remember, I had got rid of everything and started from stretch last year. And it really started back with honey. January, I only took like a few months break last year. Had a lot going on. So, yeah, you guys. So, I hope you guys like this video. And until next time, happy shopping and happy savings. Bye.